Hello everybody, welcome to a new game. This is Goner. It's not a brand new game. It's a game that I've I kind of saw a while back and kind of wanted to play, but I got it on the Steam sale for like two dollars. And I figured, hey, why not do like maybe a one or two off? Is that a thing? Two off? Why is everything in the background changing colors? Uh, a couple episodes, maybe one, maybe two. I don't know. We'll see how I like it. Let's, uh, I don't know. This could be a good idea to see if you like it too. You know, maybe something you want to play. This is a uh, roguelite, as everything else is. I'm, I am actually moving around right now. I, am I? So when I double jump, I'm actually creating land for myself. That's kind of cool. Look at this whale dude. He's just having a good old time. I have no idea what I'm doing. F. I, I can't get on the whale. What am I gathering? What are these things? What? Okay, I got a picture. Uh, I don't... Is that saying words? I don't know if that's saying words or not. Well, we're going up a hill now. I got a head! I'm happy now. <laughs> okay. Is this a roguelite? I thought this was a roguelite. With guns. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can wall jump. Okay, so that's what this is. Do I have a gun now? Oh, it's got limited bullets. So if you've got limited bullets, that means... I won't always be able to kill something. I also have bombs. Press use. Oh, it's a reload. It was a reload canister. So does it... Interesting. Oh, what? I just got eaten by something. Alright, so did the game just start now? This is so weird. Also, there's a... Oh! Alright, so that ends the level. Good to know. Probably should have known that earlier. Can I aim up? No, I can't. What is this? How do I... Come here, you. Oh, it's a shotgun. We got a shotgun now. It seems like it's heavier. Heavier, but stronger. Got to reload. So do I have a limited or unlimited number of reloads? I don't... I don't quite understand. I could use a bit better timing than that, though. So, oh, that's like a free reload, so I don't have to worry about it, maybe? I, I don't know what's going on! <laughs> oh, that guy was spiky, scary, man. Oh! That was interesting. He stole my heart. Just reload. This guy's gonna... My skull's up there now. Hey, treasure chest? What's in here? Hearts. They have my gun. Get off my gun. You monsters! Oh! Alright, I'm really bad at this game, apparently. They did it again! Those sneaky... Muggers. I 
This is weird. I don't understand what the heck is going on. It happened again. All right. Well, I probably should have went back to the other skull because I have one heart left. We're about to die again. This run is dead. This run is dead. Yeah, I don't have high hopes here. Get out of here with that. At least there's like no secret enemies. Huh. Alright, so I'm starting to get the hang of this. Trick is to just shoot the crap out of everything in near you. Looks like treasure chests ha uh, until I'm proven otherwise. It looks like treasure chests just have hearts in them. Reload. Oh, that's a three for one shot, man. That's what I call efficiency. I have no idea what these things we're collecting in the corner are. What about these? Oh, are we in a shop? I don't know what that is. I can't even tell what these guns are. I'm guessing what I have in the top right is... Currency. I don't know what's happening. What even is this? This is... This is probably the most abstract roguelite game I've ever played in my life. Oh my god. Huh. He got me. I think I'm starting to understand. Uh, uh, no! What was that? Roguelike, like, like? <laughs> okay. What happened? This is how I start now. Oh. I kind of like that shark thing. So, more money to regenerate more possibilities. So it's like a uh, double down kind of mechanic, I guess. Dead, got him. Give me all your stuff. I got some currencies. Um, so I guess because I had so much currency, it allowed me to have an extra life. What the hell is that? What? It's a giant whale! Ooh, how bizarre. How bizarre. How bizarre. This is so weird. What is this... stupid game? Ah! They got me. Where's my skull? Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright. I'm dead. All right, well. Visit death? What does that do? Oh, it's telling me the skulls I have collected? 
And then I can start with, I guess? The guns I can start with? I like my shotgun. The reloads I could start with, I guess? So I guess you're sort of incentivized... The music reminds me a lot of Terraria. You're sort of incentivized to, uh... Kill everything on the level. Just spray bullets everywhere. You're incentivized to kill everything on the level to hopefully find... Currency. And I got free currency from doing the tutorial. So it seems like I have quite a bit less. What's the thing going on in the top right? Is that com- it's combos of some sort? So you're incentivized to not miss as well. Which is interesting. Die! And it seems like there's a good amount of reloads that drop from the enemies as well. What? Is that a special exit? Well, that's interesting. Doesn't this music remind you of Terraria? It's got that weird, like... ...abstract beat to it. It's not what I needed to do. I wanted to do this. What did I do? He got me! Ah, he got me again! I don't understand this jetpack thing. I mean, it looks like it's a jetpack, but I'm not sure. Do I just not understand? It's possible. This game is so... weird. Oh, it's a time stop. Give me that. We move on. This game's really neat. I don't know if I'll do a whole series on it, honestly. But, actually I need to buy this. Um, I don't know, this was a, I think this is a fun little one-off. Probably make it a little longer since I'm not planning on doing any more. But would you guys like to see more stuff like this? Like, uh... Like little one-off videos? Did. I think it'd be a good way to explore more indie games because, let's face it, the Yaffe series on my main channel is dead. And if I ever find something that's worth like making a video about, I can always make the uh, <coughs> the triple play videos about it. Let's talk to our whale friend up here. Hmm. Increases our ammo count, which is neat. It seems like it's a consistent thing. I just came out of the sphincter of that glow worm. I don't know how I feel about that. Can you not? His legs? Wait, what's this on my back? Whoa!
Did that hurt me? That hurt me. No, sir. That is not cool. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. Ah, I'm so close. Let's do another run. Alright, gave me another life? I'm confused. What dictates whether or not I'm, like, dead for good or not? Actually, I think we're back at the beginning now. Yeah, this is a weird, weird game. The colors are so abstract, but they're not unpleasing to the eyeball. Get your butt out of here. Get your butt out of here. Bop and drop the snail. That was a terrible miss. That was a terrible miss. Oh my gosh. There we go. That's more like it. Did it disappear? Why you have to disappear? What's the point of that? That's not even right. I was gonna grab you eventually. You didn't have to leave. Just because I didn't do it on your time. You're not my mom. You can't tell me what to do and when to do it. Oh, murder. Come here, you. Do I... Yeah. I do. Get out of here, hedgehog. Nobody likes you. Hey! Hey! Grab it. Grab it. Go into the secret hole. So this is like a little pachinko thing, it looks like. So I jump down here. Interesting. So I took a heart of damage, even though this is a type of bonus stage. Is that right? I don't know, it doesn't seem right to me, man. I'm not supposed to take damage on a bun- You ate me! I wasn't ready for you! You just like snuck up on me, dude. Give me that treasure. Alright, cool. Let's just hop and bop them. Pretend we're Mario. Well, let's be real, we're better than Mario. He says as he bops right into the back of a snail and takes a ton of damage. By ton, I mean literally one-third of his total health pool. That was nice. That was a good little combo we just pulled off there. Alright. Gotta be a little more careful here. You, com you coming? I was right here the whole time. Okay, that didn't feel great. Well, it looks like we get to go into this boss fight with zero health. Oh wait, we get to shop first. I'm at a skull. I kind of like the shotgun, so this might be a uh, poor choice. All 
All right, that wasn't cool. That wasn't cool. That wasn't cool either. Okay. I took a lot of damage here. You dead yet? Like, any time now. You can die. There we go. Alright. Let's move on. I like this little shark fin thing. This little rapid fire nonsense. So what I have is like this weird machine gun kind of thing. So you healed me. I got this skull thing following me now. I wish I knew what it did. There's like no text in this game at all, is there? This game is so weird. This game is so weird. Same thing I did last time! <laughs> Ugh. That was the same exact way I died last time. You would think I would learn. And you know the reason I went down there is because I did my double jump, right? The first time I died down there, I did my double jump. And as I went down there, there was this, like... There was like this, uh... Because it puts land underneath you when you do your double jump. And that's what confused me. Now we have a new weapon. It's a laser beam. I'm not going to be able to jump up to those. Are you crazy? Dude, it hurt me? Yeah. No more. He got me! Well, that was a swish if I've ever seen one. I think I'm done with this game for now, guys. <laughs> uh, I'm just like too... There's such a sensory overload with the style that I don't really know what to say about it because I don't even know what's going on most of the time. However, the general gameplay seems pretty fun. And I feel like I could get further and further if I keep on trying. But I don't think this is a game that I want to let's play. Um, if you guys want to see more like one-off stuff like this from weird indie games, let me know. Uh, cause there's definitely no shortage of them, but like I said, let me know, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!